painting for me is like an awake meditation. I can lose myself for hours in the studio. Mixing paint, those big globs of luscious color. Deciding which brush I'm gonna use next. It's such a healing, restful place to be. It's just fabulous. There was a point in my professional career as an educator where I just thought, wow, I, you know, if I'm ever going to do this and be an artist, I need to do it now. One of my basic drivers is curiosity. And part of the reason I paint is to satisfy my own curiosity about life. That sense of curiosity and that state of wonder is what I hope comes through to the viewer. The current series that I'm working on is looking back on my life and traveling to places that were important to me along the way and painting those. This looks finished. Yeah, almost. Because it's yep. painterly, it's loose, it's kind of a it's fresh. I can tell within, you know, the first 15, 20 minutes or at least the first project who is dynamic, who is interesting, who has potential. Right away Susan was doing these pastels that were way above what everyone else was doing. She was also just unbelievably focused and would work the entire three hours and would want to work another three hours. And her strengths are her brushwork. She's got really dynamic brushwork that at her best seems to come easy. She can depict a scene, translate it into fabulous, luscious brushwork. When it comes to Susan, out of the 80 or so artists whose work we carry in the gallery, with her I think we've seen some of the most rapid development. And her work, I would say, is very accessible. People get it, they get the imagery, they understand what they're looking at, but at the same time, it's not simplistic, that there is a, I wanna call it an underlying philosophical underpinnings. That's got the mystery, it's got, you know, it, it's got the, the curiosity, um, it, it pulls the viewer in, whereas this just, but anyway, I do love that. Thank you. Here in Issaquah, I have created a whole art critique group at Art East. I'd make a story about the group was having fun over there yeah. and this person was here. Yes. Or... It seems like two different paintings to me. The group, because we've all known each other, will say, Susan, I think you're being too hard on yourself. The sky in that painting is really strong. Or yeah. Susan, that painting still needs work. You thought you were done, but you're not. I'm living the dream, I'm living my dream. This is absolutely who I am and drives my every waking moment. I love being an artist and being considered an artist and being talked about as an artist. I feel like I'm at the beginning of a vast new chapter that's gonna be full of opportunities.